This is Pony Prepper Bill. Today is Sunday, February 7th, I think. Um, it's snowing today. It's snowing pretty good. Uh, the other day we had a supposed nasty snowstorm. Uh, state of emergency, you weren't allowed out. And we had about three quarters of an inch. Now, uh, this storm was coming and some things were saying that it won't be as bad as the last one we had which was less than an inch. Well, it was snowing for about an hour and a half, but we already had almost two inches. And it's still coming down. It's like uh, 1 o'clock or something. I don't know if it's noon or 1 o'clock. I'm not sure. But I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but it's snowing like crazy. Big, big, big snowflakes. Uh, I already saw an accident down the street. People with two brand new cars still had the temp tags on them the cars that are like a half an inch from the bottom of the ground while you would take that out in a snowstorm but today we're not in a state of emergency it's and the roads are super super bad so I'm going to drive around and uh, take a look and see what's out there all right we made it out here to Crowley's Landing out on the Mullica River and it's still smelling like a bitch we saw an accident um, there's people out there on the dock with their dog having a good time, having fun. I got out of my truck. As soon as we pulled in here, I got out and ass overhead. Boy, I went right on the freaking ground. Now my ass is all muddy. My ass is soaking wet. Uh, so yeah, in this kind of weather, make sure you're careful when you get out of your car. And, uh, if you take some hot chocolate with you and because it's cold out, you want some hot chocolate like we always do, don't pour the hot chocolate in a cup and stick it on top of your dash when you're parked. If you do, remember, because I took off and the hot chocolate went down into my radio, into my dash, into my cup holders. Now my radio doesn't work. It turns on, but uh, there's no display. Hopefully my heater keeps working. And now I need my ass heater uh, it's, we'll drive around, check out some more things. It's no more like a bitch. And again, accidents, cars all over the place. Luckily, there's not many people on the road because it's Sunday. But <laughs> no state of emergency this time. The other day, state of emergency, and the roads were dry as hell. It makes no sense. New Jersey is ridiculous, full of pansies. But you can come out today. <laughs> so we're going to drive around and check out some more things. Now we're here at Sweetwater Casino. Well, it's not the casino anymore. It's Sweetwater, River Deck, and Marina. Marina and River Deck. Been here since the 20s. It was an old fancy restaurant way back here in the middle of nowhere on the Mullica River. And my parents used to keep their boat here when I was a kid. And it was little by little, it got fancier and fancier. And then it became, uh, uh, what do you call it? A yacht club and it was for the rich and then it burnt down a couple years ago and they had the outside open just like uh, like bar food and stuff but they just rebuilt the whole restaurant I haven't been inside yet but it's supposedly pretty big and they're open in the summer but with this pandemic they can only open for so many people so many seating or whatever but I haven't seen the inside I know the one side, the doors open up and everything. But I don't know what the restaurant, I know they have an upstairs, but I haven't, haven't seen that yet. And of course, they're closed, so it's gorgeous out here. It's about 3 o'clock, and it's still snowing, but not as much. I think it's starting to taper off. All right, we came out here. Now we're in the town of Nesco. We went by Sweetwater. Uh, we went by Batsdo, and every time I went to film... And I pull over, the plow was coming and plowing shit in. I didn't want it to hit my truck again. And I kept pulling off the side of the road. It was a pain in the ass. So now we're in the town of Nesco. And we stopped by Farmer John's just to see how many people are out on the roads. And the roads are actually getting pretty good now. People are pulling in to Farmer John's, which is kind of like a little convenience store. And people are pulling in, getting their groceries and your eggs and your milk and uh, whatever you need. The liquor store is right down the street, and you got Riggins Gas right here. 
on our way back from Farmer John's. We're on Esco Road, which is 658. I came across this truck. Is that bad or what? It reminds me of the Jeepers Creepers truck. Looks like it's got the same front end. I'm out here in the middle of the Pine Barrens right across. I'm at the campsite right across from uh, Crowley's Landing. And this has been closed for about a year now because of the pandemic, the coronavirus. Um, you can go into the liquor stores and Walmart and all that stuff and get your coffee, get, get your whatever you need. The pot dispensaries are open, but you can't take a tent and go camping by yourself. So there's that. The snow's coming down. I almost, you missed it. I almost got whacked. A big piece of snow came down and hit my truck right where I was getting out. But it's really, it's really nice out here. We were just driving around, checking out the different trails and stuff like that. And it's, the snow's coming down. It's really not that bad out. It says it's 31 degrees out, but it feels like it's 36, 37. No wind, really. It's just really, nothing's frozen yet. I'm sure later the roads are going to get nasty once the temperature drops. But it's really pretty out here. I love the woods. I love getting away. I mean, this is almost like, you know, my backyard, but we're uh, 20 miles into the woods. It's pretty nice out here to me anyway. I like being out in the woods. I like being in the forest, the trails, in the woods. So now I guess we're on our way home, and we did a couple stops here and there. And now we made our last stop here at Harrisville Lake, right across from the old Harrisville ruins. And got planes flying up. This is Harrisville Lake. It's nice. Nobody out here today. It's nice and quiet. Nobody's in canoes. I was out here the other day and saw a couple out here with their dog and we were talking about all kinds of stuff. The snow makes these uh, woods sometimes are pretty, sometimes are uh, gorgeous, and sometimes just dark, dreary, and nasty. So I'll come out here for a little drive today in the snow. I got my my radar Riley hat on. You see that from Ash? <laughs> my Jeep hat. It's for when I'm driving the ambulance, and it keeps this from falling down over my eyes. But I just like the Pine Barrens. I like coming out here seeing the different, the contrast of the lights, the darks, the browns, the grays, the greens. And, you know, I just love the Pine Barrens. That's why I moved out here. Just figured I'd share the, the South Jersey trip with you and show you what it's like in a snowstorm. Well, this is Plenty Prepper Bill, and I'll talk to you in the next video.